That's just a perfect pass from Crowder. Absolutely perfect. And just to reiterate, there's people in here saying that's goaltending. No, that's a live basketball. Hi everyone, it's Neil Moore, culinary specialist, coming to you from our Arizona test kitchen. This is the first of a series of slam dunk Cisco brand solutions where we deep dive into products that are Cisco branded and present great savings to our customers. In each video, we are going to identify a specific product, analyze it, show you how to make a successful cutting, overcome objections, and ultimately, how to sell it. Today, we will discuss sausage gravy. On one side, I have the Cisco Classic brand, and on the other side, our contender, the Chef Mate, which is made by Nestle. Now, let's take a closer look at the two cans. Both come in number 10 size. Both pack six cans to a case. Both have the main ingredients as water and pork. And both have some ingredients that honestly you cannot pronounce. And theirs has a few more than ours. Both are well liked. Ours at 58%, theirs at 71%. But I would have expected those numbers to be completely the opposite because this one is 37% more expensive. So my first thought is that there must be something wrong with the product. Let's open the cans and take a look. So here you go. Ours and theirs. I did not treat any of them. I just straight opened up the lid and lifted it. First impressions. The Chef Mate is lighter in color, has less sausage and more fillers in it. Look how you can still see the indentations of the can in the top of the product. If I had to judge, ours had a more made from scratch, homey feel to it and in taste tests our brand easily came on top. So my thought must be another reason. Maybe theirs has greater value with more sausage. Let me show you how to do a successful cutting. Let's do a recap. Our Cisco brand tastes better, looks better, has a lot more sausage in it, and is less expensive. So why aren't we selling more of this can? I'm here to tell you that I found a reason, but you'll have to come a lot closer to take a look at it. I'm here to tell you that we messed up. Great product, but bad packaging. Look at our can wrap. It's white, boring, bad photo, and the biggest offender is that we have the words artificially whitened in bold letters at the front. In comparison, our competition has a colorful wrap with a great photo and an overall feel of made from scratch homey products. The artificial whitening refers to one ingredient specifically, titanium dioxide. It had been in use as a white food coloring for over a hundred years and is one of the seven most common natural elements. So what can you do? Talk about it. Do a cutting. Give them the price. And if they still want to pay 37% more for a good looking photo, well, I guess you should let them. But I think most of them will switch. This is Steve Moore, culinary specialist from Cisco, Arizona. Thank you.